Hello, my lovely pinup pals. It's your girl, Renee, with Patina DeVille Designs, bringing you a little bit of that rockabilly and retro flair to the planning and budgeting community here on YouTube, the best community on YouTube. So today's video is kind of like a little bit out of my normal, regular ones that I do every week. It is kind of more of like a how-to or a hack video um, with, with the the craze of the freebie thing that's going around right now. I had a couple of questions on if I had any suggestions or hacks on how to, um, I guess, organize or store all these wonderful freebies out there. And I thought that's a great little video that I want, would like to do. So I'm going to touch on some products that I got from the Dollar Tree, some hacks that I saw from other, um, creators on YouTube and I was, and I'm, and I'll give, give them a shout out. And then others, you know, I think is probably just what I see normal people do. Um, and then others just, you know, we'll see. Yeah. I, so if I'm not giving proper credit, I apologize. Um, sometimes, you know, like it's just kind of like everybody does it, but when I know that I saw somebody do it, I definitely will give them like, Oh, Hey, yeah, I saw somebody do it. So like this envelope here, I know I saw this on, um, lady die saves and she uses it for her. I think she calls it her secret stash cash or something like that. Um, I plan on using it for my different, I guess, uh, money that I'm going to hold throughout the week, you know, for my Monday minis and stuff like that. So to help me separate it out because it's going to help organize me there. But I thought this would also be another great way. Let me pull this um, open real quick and uh, like say here we've got Saving Wish Alanda's, right? And it would also, it can, if, well, if I can get it open, sorry, should have pre-done that. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, it can hold your, I think, A5s. So if you want that, that can be done, right? And then they have the ones that will go easily inside of your binder. So of course, binders are the perfect place to keep them. If you've got a spare binder to put them in, to organize them in, that's where I would suggest if you already have it. But I wanted to kind of bring up some inexpensive Dollar Tree hacks, right? So that's that's one way. Uh, this way here is a... a I saw this on uh, Beijing Girl Budgets. Kimmy was doing this envelope here for her um, March Mini Money Making Madness one, and I and it's to hold all of her, you know, March stuff. But I thought, what a wonderful idea from the Dollar Tree just to organize these. So that's what this. Where did it go? Right here. So these are just like little. Um, photo albums. So basically a photo album would be a perfect place to, to store and utilize challenges because one, it's really easy then to kind of find the style that you're feeling and, um, it holds quite a bit, right? So that is a great way. And I thought another little hack to do with these is you could even kind of like categorize them in these little, you know, these are dollar 25. So you could do it by like quarter or by holiday or by, you know, your favorite, um, uh, your favorite, your favorite creator even. Cause you know, sometimes they got lots like, uh, Mia Stia, um, I'm totally slaughtering her name. I'll have her tag below. I mean, she alone has like 90. I think that two sister bees has something like 60 of them. So literally, you know, a binder for, for just your favorite, um, savings creator could be a great idea. Or like I said, possibly maybe, um, for the quarter. So if you've got different holidays in here, that way it's real easy. You're like, oh yeah, you know, I need something for um, April or I need something for Easter or whatever the deal is. And then you know which binder these little guys would be stored in. Um, so these are $1.25 at the Dollar Tree. This video, of course, is not sponsored by Dollar Tree. <laughs> I, I'm a little guy. Nobody sponsored me. Um, another thing is from Dollar Tree is this guy right here, the Expandafile. Currently, I'm using this just to kind of like store some of my planner stickers that I've ordered. Um, and it helps to kind of keep them, you know, categorized. But I thought that would be another great way to do your savings challenges um, is keep them in the little... I guess a little file of facts folder, another dollar twenty-five over at Dollar Tree, as well as this guy here. So for the bigger ones that that you get, I'm keeping a lot of mine in here um, to keep them nice and and tidy. Um, for the ones that I don't want to use yet, so these are great at Dollar Tree. That you can get them in different colors. They've got um, I've got the mint green and the purple and the pink. But I thought I just want to kind of like show you guys this. And of course, another way a lot of people do it. Let me see here. Grab these off. Um, is just 
by having yourself, like I grabbed, uh, what was this? A, a, what's called the big classic happy planner cover. These are just discs that I got off of Amazon and then I punch. So this is my big book of savings that I'm use, utilizing right now. But the ones that I don't use, I have stored here in the back and the, for a future, you know. So that's just another idea that, of course, is not from the Dollar Tree, but just wanted to kind of throw that out there. Um, I had a couple of ladies asking, oh, what's that book? What's that book? And so, yeah, that's just kind of something I created. Those are discs that I bought off of Amazon. I will have that kind of stuff linked below. So if you guys want to go and click my affiliate links, awesome. Um, but either way, I hope that kind of helped. Um, I, I'm excited about all these wonderful freebies and I'm getting some other... Uh, you know, challenges coming in that I got from Etsy and stuff. And so I want to kind of keep them separated. So I will have my freebies, the ones that I don't want to cut up yet, the big ones in one folder. I will have the ones that I purchased in another folder. That way I properly introduce them when I'm talking about them in my channel. I'm, you know, um, cause I'll have the Friday freebies and then, you know, minis will be a mixture of freebies as well as, um, ones that I paid for and uh, yeah, savings challenges and stuff like that. So I try to keep them categorized separately in different envelopes. So it's a little easier for me to remember as I'm kind of like introducing, you know, the actual challenge. So this is my all freebies one right here. You guys saw some of that video, or maybe you guys saw the video, but yeah, hope that helps. And uh, yeah, if you think you know somebody that might uh, like the video, please share it with them. I would appreciate that or tag them down below. Thanks again for hanging out with me, you guys. And I don't know when this video is coming up, so I don't know what's coming out tomorrow, but make sure that you are subscribed. Click the bell icon because it will, it will, uh, I guess, alert you when something new comes out that I, that I put out and I would love for you to, to join me. All right. Thanks again, guys. Bye.